speak to us about specific blood types. Is there a blood type in the country that is desperately needed or is there a blood type that can be used for more than one type of person? Well, the group O blood, um, most people are aware of the ABO system. Uh, that's the most commonly used blood grouping system, that and the RH, um, which means that you get group O positive, O negative, A positive, A negative, and so on. Um, also A, B, and B. Now, some of them are less um, common than others. For instance, AB negative, which is a relatively rare blood group in that not many people have it. But the thing with that blood group is that it's also only, it can only receive that blood type. So there isn't such a great demand on it. Whereas a, group, a blood group such as group O, positive or negative, would have a huge demand because all the other blood groups can actually receive group O. It's compatible. And um, group O neg even more so because that's the most neutral blood that you can receive and that's why that's often given to infants. So some blood groups are compatible with others and some not. And But the demand for blood in terms of usage and compatibility and also emergency usage is definitely highest on group O. And that's why we often appeal to particularly group O donors to donate because those are the ones that are used for emergency cases when there is no time to actually group the patient. But even if you do have the rare blood type AB negative, for instance, somebody who has the same blood type as you in an emergency situation would desperately need your blood. So really, yes. even if you have a rare blood type, definitely you need we to need donate. all blood groups. You know, um, we often say the rarest blood group is the one that's not available when you need it. You know, so we definitely need all of them. But just in terms of the most frequent usage is probably the emergency blood. So what can we expect to see being celebrated or commemorated on World Blood Donor Day? Well, on World Blood Donor Day, throughout the world, there's usually some kind of activity in each country or in each city where the blood services would try and raise awareness. In South Africa, it's no different. Um, the Western Cape, particularly, we have a campaign running throughout the month of June called a Know Your Blood Group campaign to actually promote exactly the kind of discussion that we've had now about blood groups, to inform people of their blood group. We actually group and test them on site, and uh, we tell them which blood group they are. It's, of course, only a screen test. And then uh, we give them a little bit of interesting information about their specific blood group because we find that people are very interested in their blood group, and it's a good way to actually interact with people and try and then, of course, persuade them to become a blood donor and to show them how they can do it. But it's a great uh, activation campaign which is run in most of our shopping malls. And in the Cape on Saturday the 14th, we will be both in Blue Root Mall and in N1 City Mall. So both sides of the city will be covered and we will be running that campaign. And then, of course, we also have fixed zona sites in both of those shop shopping malls. What type of information can you give people about their specific blood group? I mean, is it different from person to person? Yes, it actually tells you on the little card, it tells you which antigen is in your blood and which antibody and with which blood group it is compatible and, you know, why your blood is so special. And, you know, we write the name of the person on the card and people love it and we've had very positive reaction to it, and I think it's something that we probably will repeat. That's fascinating. So, for instance, my blood type is A positive. That means that I have a very different makeup to somebody who was O positive. That's correct. Fascinating. Well, thank you so much for joining us today, and we wish you all the best on World Blood Donor Day. Please come and update us in the future on what you guys are up to. With pleasure. Thank you. Thank you very much.